Good morning. I welcome you all to Rishikul Online School. Dear students, today I am here with module three of model test paper for first term exam, class ninth, subject English, and I am your teacher Nisha Sharma. So this is the third question of the MTP, and as you can see that this is. A scene passage, and here also you will find MCQs in your question paper. So, the passage is: At the age of two and a half, Einstein was still not work talking. When he finally did learn to speak, he uttered everything twice. Question one: Who genius still reigns after fifty years of his death? answer is as per the passage the answer is part d option d that is einstein who has become synonymous with genius answer is option a that is einstein name the next question when was einstein born so the answer to this question is on 14th march 1879 where was einstein born he was born in a german city of ulm so the answer is mcq b what did albert's mother think of him so his mother thought that he was a freak so the answer is d part the next question that is question number 4 again this is an unseen passage this is based on the poem and the extract is when the humid shadows hover over all the starry spheres and the melancholy darkness gently weeps in rainy tears so what what poem this is yes you guessed it right it is rain on the roof so what is the poem what is this poem talk about so this poem talk about talks about rain falling so the answer is b what revives the sweet memories in the poet's mind and the answer is rain drops falling on the roof that is part c next question which literary device has been used in this poem and the answer r is alliteration and personification which memories of the poet are revived with the pitter patter sound of rainfall and the answer is childhood memories with the spelling of childhood is wrong we will be doing it correct what does starry spheres mean it means the sky filled with stars then next question What is the favorite activity of the poet during the rainy season? So the favorite activity of the poet is to lie down on the bed and listen to the pitter patter sound of the rain. That is D part. Now grammar section. In this section, you will find ten questions, and again they are MCQs. So you will have to choose the correct option. out of the options given so the first question says dash to australia guinea yes to is a go so the answer is have you ever been that is c part tokyo is dash city i have ever lived in and the answer is the biggest part c next question a vegetarian is someone who does not eat meat answer is a i dash these days so there are some words given in jumble form so we have to find out the correct uh, correct jumble words so these are i never buy a newspaper these days that is b part i dash watch tv tonight The answer is I'm going to watch TV tonight. I wish I dash more money. That is answer is 
आई विश आई हैड मोर मनी डैश बी फेमस वन डे वुड यू लाइक टू बी फेमस वन डे दैट इज आंसर इज पार्ट बी इट्स माई बर्थ डे ऑन फ्राइडे सो द आंसर इज ए पार्ट आई डैश एटीन ईयर्स ओल्ड आई एम येस यू गेज इट करेक्ट इट इज आई एम एटीन ईयर्स ओल्ड नेक्स्ट आई डैश ए हैड एक सो द आंसर इज सी आई हैव ए हैड एक so this is the end of module 3 3 tomorrow i will meet you with the new module till then take care